Hi Libra, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your weekly reading for, oh, what is it, August 20th through the 26th, that one flipped over, so we're taking it. We're going to get two of these, and then we're going to break into that tarot deck. Um, so this is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Typically my readings are love readings, we will see whatever comes up. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. Can you believe it? Or are you in denial? Now remember, this reading may not be yours. But then again, if you're in, if you're in denial, you would think that anyway, right? Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. So what this card tells me is your soulmate is probably not who you think it is. This person is not your usual type. Keep an open mind, but you have to, and you have to release. And, you know, if something didn't work out, you definitely want to have an open mind and look for something different this time. Undesirable news. I don't like what I hear. I don't want to hear it. You may be hearing something that you don't want to hear about your happily ever after, whatever it is. You may be seeing something you don't want to see. Wow, look at this. You have the power, the power is in your hands to manifest. You have to find the strength and the courage and the confidence to manifest, to bring success to your life, to bring happiness to your life. You have to accept the truth, whatever it is, even if it hurts. I feel like you are receiving some sort of message, even if it's through me or I don't know who. And it's not what you're hoping to hear and, that, and you do need to find the strength to deal with it. And to, to find your resources within to perhaps release it even. Because the magician uses his magic to evolve, to shed whatever is needed. He, he does whatever he has to do to bring success to his life. Yeah, you guys are carrying a very heavy load. Okay? Heavy, heavy. And, you know, you're dealing with somebody that isn't putting in much effort. They aren't working hard enough. And, and you have a cycle that is trying to complete right now. 10, 10, 10. Okay? Completion, completion, completion. But the fact of the matter is, is you're trying, you're clinging to the control. You don't want this change of course when this change of course is destined to happen. Destiny is playing out and you're trying to stop it. Eventually you're going to break down and collapse. You have to find the power, the force within you to drop something, to drop it. So that you can be happy. 
It's a time of, of acting with integrity, of doing the right thing. Coming up with a plan B. Take charge. Self-love. Follow your intuition. Use your intuition to help you. You're probably really emotional at this time. You may be a little defensive, but you're also very beautiful, so don't forget it. Man or woman, you have a lot of beauty going on. And it, you know, it, it, it's a time to celebrate. Go out and have some fun. You know, you could be receiving a new offer from someone else that maybe you maybe you're dating. Maybe one of your friends could hook you up with somebody. Maybe it's a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We have Leo, we have Gemini, we have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But this is about being playful. Getting out there, having fun. Go have some fun. Let go of this heavy load. Put that weight down. Put it down. Allow yourself. Be willing to shed this heavy weight and broaden your horizons, please. You will only continue to get bad luck by trying to manifest something that isn't meant to be. You have to leave it in the universe's hands. You know what I mean? You can manifest love, but you can't put a name on it. Somebody is trying to control destiny, trying to control fate, trying to change or trying to control the course. And it's not in your control. Like I said earlier, you need to regain your focus. You need to regain your concentration. You need to relight that fire within you. And, and you need to, you know, the, the, the worst is over. The worst is over. You need to allow yourself to continue to heal without looking back. But you're still looking back with that wheel reversed. You know, real suffering brings true growth. And I think that you guys have found a lot of strength in this suffering that you've been through. A lot of strength. I mean, strength, strength, the suffering. You've, you have gained so much strength from this suffering. Your power has multiplied. But now you may, not, you may still be living in some sort of illusion. It's time for a reality check. It's time to accept some sort of truth, whatever it is. The truth has been revealed and you know what it is. You know, when the when the universe doesn't give you what you want, it's because they have a better blessing in store for you. I feel as though wish fulfillment is on the way. You are being protected from something. And now, now the universe has a gift for you of some sort. Because you've had to go through some quite a bit of grief. I see grief. But you you can't self love is 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 prominent here okay you have to love yourself you can't ask for the universe to make somebody fall in love with you that isn't the right one and i know that's what this is you need to find that force within you to accept reality that if something in a loving relationship didn't work out it was for your protection you were being protected this really is a time of hope and inspiration and renewal and healing. You've done a lot of healing. You are going to get some sort of, of happiness out of this suffering. But 
Right now it's stalled. Right now it's halted. It's not happening because you're, you're hindering it by that Wheel of Fortune reverse, trying to control, trying to think that, you know, you know, and we all do this, so I'm not just pointing the finger at you, but, you know, that, that clinging to control, clinging to what I think is fate. Right now, wish fulfillment, the ultimate wish fulfillment, you know, you have the power to manifest wish fulfillment and happiness, but like I said, you cannot put a name on it. You have to let the universe bring you what is meant to be. And and this is it's halted, it's stalled, it's stopped, it ain't coming right now. Even though they it's there, it's in the background. But right now you may be feeling a little bitter, a little resentful, a little angry, and a little you're not being somebody's not being logical. Not making the right decision. King of Swords reversed. Moody, back and forth, up and down. Impatient. Trying to make, this is, you know, this is a card of alchemy. And this is a card of alchemy. Somebody is trying to will something or turn something into something that it isn't. There's a lack of peace, there's a lack of balance, there's a lack of harmony, and there's a lack of, of allowing. Allow the universe to bring you what you need. The right situation. Your wish. Your true wish. But you, you are, some of you are deaf. There's, we, have, there's, we have illusion here. We do in a couple different spots. Trying to, you know not see things clearly you have to make a complex decision you have other options but you need to get moving have no fear have no fear of the future put yourself first for once for once libra Whew, it's time for you to be happy again it is somebody has brought you to your knees and now it's time to cut them out and it's time for you to be happy again. Sever those ties. Stop hanging around. Stop sacrificing yourself needly, needlessly for something that isn't just. There's nothing solid, stable that you can take to the bank with whatever it is that you are holding on to, that you're sacrifice, sacrificing yourself for. There's nothing solid there. There's nothing stable. There's nothing long-term. You can't manifest the wrong one or the wrong situation. That'll bring you bad karma, the bad luck, the wheel of fortune reversed. It's time to give up. It's time to give up on something that is no no longer stable or solid. It's a dead end situation of whatever it is. Let go of the that old idea. Because you have somebody that is better suited. There's an opportunity <laughs> with somebody that is not your usual type. This is what this is. That's what the lover's card is. It's an unexpected choice in love with somebody that you that you didn't expect. And this isn't the one that you thought it was. It's somebody completely different. And it's a blessing that is being given to you from above. You have an opportunity for a soulmate connection where this person will come into your life and bring peace and harmony and healing. This person will help you to heal from this ex. There's an opportunity for a soulmate connection with somebody that is not your usual type, but there is a mutual attraction. And you know it, but you're scared of it. Release. Allow this new love to blossom and grow. This person is not your usual type because the usual type didn't work. 
keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. You are so, so... You are so, 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 so beautiful. You are. It's about time you get what you deserve and you know what you're worth. Somebody sees your beauty and they see your worth. And they're coming after you. And it's a strong bond. It is. With this card and this card. There's, a, there's an opportunity for a rebirth here. A birth of something beautiful and new that will allow growth with somebody that will love you and is meant to be. Don't let manipulation and lies hold you back. I have to look at these cards in many ways. You're only sabotaging your own happiness by staying in a situation that is a dead end. It's a time of growth. It's a time of renewal. It's a time of birth. There's a birth of a new love for you, Libra. Release your ex. Keep an open mind. This person isn't your usual type, but you should do it. Just go for it, please. I think this person could be a water sign, could be a Leo, could be anybody. But I don't think it's somebody from your past. That card would suggest it's not. Talk to you later.